door was locked and I, I woke up and I saw somebody down there where that rocking chair is and I thought mama was sitting there. And I don't know if I said something to her, but I just remembered that the bedroom door was locked. And I sat up in bed and it moved all the way toward me and it had on black and white stripes that ran down and had a hood. I can, and I kept thinking, I'm going to see the face. I never saw a face, but it got right to me and then it went up all the way to the corner of the room and went out. And it was black and white stripe, like something like a TV would look or something? No, just black and white. The stripes went down and it was long. It was like a long cape with a hood. And I kept thinking it's going to um, get, uh, you know, because it walked from the end of the bed to me. Mm -hmm. It walked and stand right beside me. And I was sitting up. And, and then, then went up to the corner right above my place. head, all the way to the corner and disappeared. And I remember, I can tell you the pictures that were on the wall because it was, it was bright. It was bright enough till I could see even the pictures on the wall. And... I got up and went and sat in the living room thinking, what in the world? I don't know. I always thought I told you that story. No. <clears throat> but I never, I've never been afraid of it. Well, I don't think it is what people say it is. I don't think it's what it is. I don't think it's ghosts. I don't think it's dead people. I really don't. There's something more to it. <laughs>